Okay, so this is part two of the water bottle flip game. Let's get to where I can share it. Okay, so if you remember, we created our game. Just to refresh your memory, let's see if I can land one. Remember, I didn't land one last time, so. All right, so again, this is how it's going to be looking. I was able to sort of get one there. That was cute. So again, using the down button, I can stop it. So it's not it's not impossible. Tough though. Let's see if we can make this game now. So we have all this. One thing I want you to add is okay. No, no, no. we did the behavior. So let's start coding. We should be able to start coding now. We didn't add audio yet, but let's not worry about that. Let's go to event sheet. First thing, we are going to add um let's do the score. Add global variable, put score, leave all that. Okay. Now let's go to add event. We're gonna do system on start of layout. Let's wait, hold on. Let me just move something out the way. On start of layout, add action, put system set value in the global variable area, score to zero. So leave that, set score to zero, okay. Now, go to event number two. Um, System, every tick, all right? So every time the game is just running, every tick of the game, uh, this is really important. Action, let's go to bottle top. We gotta set its position to the water bottle. All right. Otherwise, the bottle top is just going to be loose. So the bottle top is going to be connected to the water bottle. This is how we do do this. Go so bottle top set position to a, another object. All right. And we're going to have to go back and do something. We're going to put water bottle. Now, it's on image point zero that might be okay i guess that actually might be fine so let's hit done i want to go back to layout for a second um, don't worry about the dogs <laughs> water bottle um if you could check I don't know. so image point we could put it here all right, so that's image point zero, putting it right there. So the water bottle top is going to be connected to that area. Eli. Okay. So we have that going on. So that should be now connected. So it should be connected. What else are we going to add? Um, We can use for this one on every tick, let's set the score. So what I did was go to score. Or text, it will be text for you probably. Set value should be set. No, set text. Set text to score. So you should be able to just type in score just like that. Done. All right, so we have that. How's it looking so far? Yeah, that's falling. All right, so for these, we're gonna have to put um, we're gonna have to put that with a behavior and gosh, let's put the text here. We we forgot to do that. So I'm just setting up the text. 
had an extra one there. I can definitely erase that one. Text. I'm trying to erase this one here. There we go. Don't need that. So I'm going to have to add another text there. Add the text back there. I'm trying to. Okay, there we go. Now let's put um there you go, put a zero. All right, we can make the size bigger, right? So text zero. Put it to probably uh, like that. So let's see how that's looking now. All right. So we have our score there. Now, I was saying for the bottle landers, let's add a behavior. We're going to put physics. We didn't do that on the last one. Physics. And we want to make them immovable. For the bottle landers, let's make them immovable. So right here. Now, the water bottle will connect to that. And you see we have this uh, trying to connect to there. That is going to have to get fixed. So let's check out the water bottle again. Maybe try putting the image point up there. And let's make sure how this is looking. Uh, Okay, that's not too bad. Maybe put that right there. Make sure that's looking okay. Let's see how the bottle top is looking again. See, it's, it's connecting there. So maybe um, for the bottle top, you might want to make this a little smaller. It's hard to see. Now I'm going to zoom in a little bit. You zoom in. A little bit so I can see it. There we go. Maybe we want to try. You're going to have to try adjusting that. And make it look just perfectly. With that. So this is going to have to. Fix a little bit. So you're going to have to keep playing around. With that. Let me hit the. Water bottle again. Hmm. So. Maybe stretch it out even more. Maybe put it there. Let's see how that's looking now. We just, again, trying to make it perfect. Okay. I'll leave it like that for right now, and we'll see how the game works. We'll see. Okay. Let's go to next event. Bottle top. So now we want to put bottle top on collision with another object and oh we're gonna choose so bottle top on collision with the bottle lander done add action system add add to score you can put we can put one I put 0 0.5 for me 0 0.5 but you could put one if you want at 0 0.5. So every time the bottle top lands on the, the bottle lander, it's going to add score. Let's go to uh, event four keyboard. This is a really important one on key pressed. We're going to, I like doing the space bar. Okay. Feel like it's a nice easy key to press over and over to flip the bottle on the space key press water bottle this see this one is the fun part water bottle eli water bottle um apply is it on water bottle okay water bottle 
apply physics, but it's going to be impulse. Apply physics, impulse. So, apply impulse. Um, so what I did was put 50 for here, 800 for here. You might have to adjust these. We'll see how, how it's working. You might have to shrink the bottle size. You might have to play around with this or add less or more. This is where, you know, it's, it's actually kind of fun, this part. Image on image point zero. All right, so let's test it out. Let's see what's going on. If I hit the space bar, you can, you see it's flipping around. And that's kind of cool. And I got the bottle top. Somehow I got a point because it hit. Okay, okay. I got a point because it's kind of hitting the, <laughs> it's hitting the on the bottle lander. So actually everything's working, which is really good so far. So I'm going to make a part three for it. But before I do that, Maybe, you know, you can try shrinking. Like for me, I'm going to shrink my water bottle. And let's see how this is looking. And I, and I want to shrink my um, um bottle top. I'm going to shrink it just a little bit and see how better it's going to look with it. I, I really think that should be smaller, in my opinion. The bigger it is, the easier the game is. All right. So we haven't added a down yet. So let's let's do that before part three. Go to back to event sheet and and we'll stop here after this one and, and make a part three. Go to keyboard. Um on key press. This way you can actually start playing around with your game on key press and let's put the down the down is going to help slow it slow your um bottle all the way down so on down press so here we go we got to put some actions water bottle set not wet set <laughs> physics it should be um got to set it to immovable. There it is. Set immovable. Done. Add action. System. We're going to put wait. And we could put not one second. I would do 0 0.1 seconds. But we want it to be quick. We don't want it to get frozen too long. It has to look really realistic. Um, and we'll let put water bottles set physics. Well, set mo movable. So go set immovable. But when you hit that, you should be able to change it to movable. So you hit the down. It stops it. Wait 0.1 seconds. And then it can start moving normal again. So let's test it out. Hit the space bar, hit the down button, see? And you can try to land it. All right. So again, if if it's not like jumping high enough, then you can change it. All right. You might want to adjust the size or the elasticity or the density. It's having trouble landing directly on it. So you might need to play around with it, maybe make it smaller. We'll see what's going on. So make sure you save it and get ready for part three coming up. Good job, guys.